There's another piece of legislation that would affect the state schools called the Teacher Protection Act. Some argue, though, what's designed and proposed to protect teachers and that measure actually puts minority students at a disadvantage. Christina Laurie is here to explain. Good morning. Good morning, Adam. This bill comes from Representative Jerry Thiesfeld, a former teacher himself who now serves in the state assembly. It would require police officers to report violent incidents involving students to their schools and would allow teachers in turn to initiate suspension against students. According to the most recent data from the Department of Education, one in every four teachers in Wisconsin has reported being attacked by a student in the past year, the highest in the country. Proponents of the bill say it'll help teachers feel more safe in the classroom, allowing them to focus on what really matters, teaching. But critics argue the bill will disproportionately affect black students and only worsen the problem of moving students from classrooms and into the criminal justice system. Madison Teachers Incorporated released this statement, saying they believe the best solutions for addressing disruptive behaviors and school safety come from teachers, parents, and students being empowered to act on these matters in their local schools. If you'd like to learn more about this bill, today is your chance. At 8.30 this morning at the State Capitol, Room 415, a public hearing will be held on the Teacher Protection Act. A counselor, parent, and a school board member are all scheduled to speak about the bill's potential effects. Should, be a, should be a very interesting conversation. I'm sure Absolutely. a lot more people will show up as well. Christina Lowry reporting. Thank you so much.